important is it that the players get back to, to a positive result tomorrow night after what happened on Saturday? Yeah, I think it's massive, but I think that's the case with any weekend, especially after a loss. Everyone wants to go out and put it right. I think, obviously, disappointing, especially last weekend. I think the two games before, to be fair, obviously, two teams at the top of the table, we've ran them close. And I don't think we should really get too downbeat by them two, but obviously, we should be beating Southampton. And I guess for you, it's about you know saying to the manager, look, the team aren't performing, here's my chance now to, to show you what I can do. Yeah, effectively, yeah. I've just got to show what I can do in training and then whatever minutes I get on the pitch, show that I deserve to be playing. And at the moment, six loanies at the football club, including yourself, only five are in a match day squad. How intense is training to try and make sure you're one of those loanies included? Um, training's intense, obviously, but I don't think that's the reason. I think training's just intense anyway. I don't think that's up to it or anything like that. Um, how are you, what are you enjoying your spell here at Lincoln? Yeah, really enjoying it. Obviously, um, training's been good. Get on well with the lads, so I'm enjoying time. Obviously, a bit disappointed in the last couple of weeks not to be playing because no one's no one's happy to be sat on the bench. But yeah, apart from that, and are you thriving under the the competition you've got now? Yeah, I think so. I think there's obviously a lot of a lot of competition now. Uh, quite a few attacking players brought in, so it's obviously something you've got to overcome and obviously prove that you should be playing instead of. And are you enjoying being out on loan rather than spending time at Southampton playing 23s football? Yeah, definitely. I think obviously I experienced it last year. It was my first taste, and I think I don't think 23s football really compares. And, and is that important, do you think, for a lot of young players that they, they don't feel settled at a Premier League side, they need to get out and play men's football? Yeah, definitely. I think obviously everyone has different pathways to get wherever they need to get to, but I think if, you, if you're stuck in the 23s for two years, I think it's probably time to look to get men's football under your belt and experience a different kind of football. Um, and the fact that you are playing regularly, you know, you're getting a lot of, of football, do you feel you're developing as a player in this land spell? Yeah, definitely. Um, yeah, I feel like I'm a much better player than when I came. See, learning from the manager every day, the different players here, and obviously getting the match experience come Saturday is massive. Lovely. Well, Jay, obviously there's been quite a, a lot of new faces through the door. What's the general morale like on the training ground? Has it been a, a bit of a buzz since, since the new faces have come in? Yeah, it's been good. I think, obviously, when new players come in, it brings that little bit of competition. And so I think everyone's kind of... I've played games we won before, but I think it just brings that buzz, and everyone's everyone's been on it, yeah. And then obviously, what's what's your views on on playing under the lights on a, on a Friday night? Do you think that gives you a sort of a different different feel of the game at all? Or? Yeah, I think so. I think when it's obviously an evening game, I, I personally prefer. I know a few of the lads do. I think it just brings a bit more of a buzz, a bit more of an atmosphere, and everyone just seems a bit more on it. Mm, it's great, cheers. Um, Jake, what do you what do you see as your ideal position in the team? Obviously, we sometimes see you wide, sometimes as, as that number ten just behind the forward player. Where where do you think you're best? Uh, I'd say ten. I think that's where I've grown up playing. I think that's where I'm best suited to kind of how I play. Uh, obviously, I'm comfortable on either wing as well. Okay, that's it. Just